What's up guys, here's a video on how to do a time lapse with your GoPro Hero 3 or 3 Plus or any time lapse in this case with the new update which is Mavericks for your Mac. So let's get right into this video. So in order to do a time lapse you have to plug in your micro SD card or SD card in that case into your um, Mac and you have to go up to file new movie and then click the blank movie option and then title it whatever you want. I just titled mine GoPro time lapse right here. So then it's gonna bring you to a blank um, movie right here which this you wouldn't normally see pictures right here. This will be blank also. So then you're gonna go up to import and then select your I'll just click it import and then select your micro SD card so that would be no name. You would select that. That way you could see all the pictures. So then you just hit import all and this is where I am right now. So as you can see all my pictures from my time lapse are right here. So then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click on the first photo. Hold down shift. Actually scroll all the way down to the last photo. Hold in shift and click the last photo. What that's going to do is it's going to highlight all the photos. That way you can just click any photo like this. Drag it down to your your movies or the final. You're going to place it right there. So now you have all your pictures down here. And as you can see, they are one second apart. So if I were to hit play right now, it's going like that. So that's really choppy. It doesn't really look good. So you're going to want to pause it. You're going to want to go up to adjust. And then hit this little eye icon right here. Click that. And then over here you'll see duration. So let's try a half a second. So, oh, whoops. So once you get, you, these have to be highlighted in order for you to edit them. So you have to go up here once you highlight them. I just said. We're going to try 0 0.5 and see how that comes out. So as you can see right up here, they are 5 seconds each. So now if I hit play, it's a little bit smoother but it's still kind of choppy so let's try to speed it up a little bit more let's try like 0 0.3 do that that's a little bit better but it's still kind of choppy but you kind of get the idea on how to do this time lapse with the new Mavericks so here's a playing through but now if I'm gonna try to get it a little bit smoother and try 0 0.1 See how that comes out. So as you can see, that is a little bit better. You get a little bit better effect. But I'm sure there's some other ways on how to do time lapses. There's a bunch of other tutorials, but I found out there really isn't any tutorials on how to do it on Mavericks. So I figured I'd make a video on it. But normally what I would be able to do is I would be able to go to my new event. And I would be able to bring up a little sidebar up here. So you could edit the uh, clips that way. But then what you can do once you get it all set up, you can enhance the photos, make it tweak it a little bit, make it look a little bit better and like have the sky a little bit bluer and stuff like that. But this basically gives you a good idea on how to do it on Mavericks. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it taught you guys something. So if you enjoyed it, please hit that like button and subscribe button down below because I'm going to be posting more tutorials and different technology videos and giveaways on new Apple products and stuff like that. So make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel. That way you don't miss out on those videos and it will show up in your subscription box. So off of that, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.